Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. Yeah, we gonna talk. You yeah. something else because I, I done heard a lot about you since you left. You don't know that though. Yeah, I got oh, yeah. your number. Yeah, yeah, yeah. you pair view days. I, I, you was you engineering your own music. You your own. You like a one stop shop type dude. I thought that was so impressive with the people that I had the whole prime time click up here. Yeah, I had the whole thing. Yeah, uh, yeah. It's just paint, cat. Oh yeah, yeah. TJ, shout out to TJ. Uh, Tasia Alexa. Tasia, she was yeah, yeah, yeah. She didn't want to claim it, but I said yeah, nigga, yeah. you prime time yeah, yeah. click. Was, I said yeah, you she was, was there. Going to some of the shows. Man. Yeah, Tasia she was said in the it. I, yeah, sure. I say, and uh, but they always valued your work ethic. Yeah, yeah. I, I like that because they all couldn't be lying on you. It was yeah. a respect for the way that you, the way that you grind. Especially that's the same thing that uh, 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 Watt said. Same thing. Like yeah, he, yeah. he does. He has this particular way. He wants something. He's gonna make it happen that way. Yeah, and I like yeah. that. Man, that's a hustler, man. Yeah, yeah. Now when I uh. I mean, when I got that's there, early on. Yeah, when I got another PV, I just saw what it was. I saw an open, an open field. You know what I'm saying? I, I was coming out of hoop, and I was trying to choose if I was gonna rap a hoop, but it was never no nothing. So you, you kind of automatically hit the hustle. You feel me? I, that was just naturally in me. I don't know really. That might come from my pops or something. Just yeah. a grind. But uh, I just saw everything like I'm trying to do something, and it ain't no. This, 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 and that. So that means I'm gonna have to do it myself. I'm gonna have yeah. to get these things myself. Cause otherwise, I would just go to these things. I'm thinking about what I'm trying to do, what I'm trying to make happen, what I'm trying to create. If 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 it's an easy way to do it, then of course. Cause I'm really just trying to focus on what I'm create. But not coming from how we come from, even coming from the city of Dallas, you gotta be some type of hustler. I don't care what nobody say. You gotta get it out the mud some kind of way it's impossible not to and that's what in whatever you do whatever you do it ain't got to just be music you know what i'm saying because a lot of the just the way the city was, was structured and a lot of resources that's even here now ain't been here you know what i'm saying and this and we still lack some resources in some in some ways yeah but with that being said the flip side of it is it make you a hustler make you that's a hustler. why when I, I can go to a place like la and Kind of out hustle everybody in my own way because just by coming from Dallas, I'm naturally doing it. I, I got to you know stop you because that's what Taylor Taylor said the same thing. Taylor Gabriel, the okay. play for the San, for oh, yeah. Atlanta Falcons, like document it. You can research it and look it up. Uh, I go upstairs, man, and I go into the GM's office. I knock on his office and uh, I look at him and tell him, like, sir, if you give me an opportunity to be on this team to sign me to a mini camp, I'll be the best decision that you've ever made in your career. I told him that the GM that I told him that I'm I'm betting on myself, so he uh he were you nervous going up there to even say that <laughs> man I, you know I'm from Dallas man. Yeah, you know, man. I believe I'm in me the D, man keep it going you man. know what I'm saying I'm from the D I'm finna, I'm gonna shoot my shot my shot finna get it, it's, oh, it's okay. finna, I'm gonna shoot it okay so I I I believe in me at the end of the day that's good when hearing all this I I honestly believe in myself no matter the situation. See, so, mm -hmm. I'm from Dallas. Like I gotta go do it. I'm like it's something in yeah, him that kept yeah. saying, "Man, I'm from Dallas." Like when you when you from Dallas and you go to other cities, and you start actually seeing what you made of what Dallas made of you. You yeah, know what I'm saying? You yeah. don't know that being in Dallas. Like I didn't know this until I moved to LA. LA, yeah. Like and I just noticed how I was moving, and and people will pick up on it. But it was just natural. You know yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah. Then I started realizing like, oh, because other it's other people that I could. You know what I'm saying? Shout out that you know I run into people like like in LA like uh, shout out the hood boss. You know what I'm saying? Okay. Shout out, you know shout out saying? hood boss. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I would just run into a lot of people from when I would run into people from Dallas and LA or different places. They always was making something happen. They was always making something happen better than other people, and then I'd just be like, it gotta be the city. Like this is just no naturally how to hustle if they from Dallas for some yeah. reason. When you just get in another app, your instincts keep kicking. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Because I start seeing. Even people that's behind the scenes, you know what I'm saying? I meet people and I can just be, damn, like, they move, I, like, they from Dallas, you know what I'm saying? Wow, that's just, dope. It's hard to explain. Now, when you go to other cities, the other cities notice that, and you start noticing about yourself because people, by the way people move, the way they talk to you, the way they even say, you know, this, this, and that. But long story short, like, the flip side of not having those resources in the city turn you into a hustler in some kind of way, which benefits you in another way. Wow. So you might be, you know, you might feel like, oh, well, shit, we don't got this, this, and that, but it's a benefit to everything. You know, you, you're going to learn how to hustle. You get somewhere else, you're going to see you're going to be the number one hustler in a, in a sense. Number one hustler. You're going to have some type of instincts that you get from your city. And every city got them. Every city got their own side. Somebody from New York coming to Dallas right now, 
and they live here and they know a certain guests way. Like that. They gonna be a certain way. They gonna be moving. And then we gonna see it. We gonna know this like how they like, move. Yeah, exactly. And to them, that's just how they move, and vice versa. And then some of it's gonna work against of it, against them, and some of some of it's gonna work, work for them. them. That's right. You know so it just be like that. And then you know, when I went to LA, that's what I would notice. Hey. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gonna talk.